here we are, we're running in, in Vulcan, and uh, we have currently 50 schools of fish. So there's quite a lot of uh, fish, but there's currently 5,000 fish per frame. I can make things a little more interesting. I can go up and have some more fish over here. So. Now, we can have um, different threads, um, number of threads. Now, they're currently at eight, eight threads. Uh, now, this is a Tegra K1, so we actually have four CPUs uh, in here, so we can take that down to four threads. Now, it's interesting, so you can see the loading. So you can see the loading is actually uh, being pretty well distributed across uh, the multiple threads. Now, the interesting thing is the CPU is essentially doing two things. It's animating all of the movement of the fish, and it's actually drawing them onto the screen. I can pause the animation. And you can see the CPU load goes down to almost zero. So this is, we're still drawing this at 27.9 frames a second. So all those draw calls are still happening. We're just not doing all the fish animation. You can see that the Vulcan overhead is actually very low. We're hardly taking any CPU at all uh, to drive this amount of work. Now, we can do something illustrative. This is not recommended for you to do in a real application. At the moment, we're drawing 100 fish per draw call, which is good. We're batching up uh, a bunch of work into each draw call so we don't uh, overload uh, the CPU. But we can actually take this down all the way down to one. Now we're doing one draw call per fish, and the Vulcan efficiency is there. So it, the frame rate doesn't change at all. We're still not bottlenecked uh, on the GPU. So and we, see that we're getting now 650,000 draw calls a second on a mobile tablet. And if I could zoom out, which I can't, I need a controller, you can get close to about a million. You can get about a million draw calls on a mobile device. Mm -hmm. Now, if I go to OpenGLDS with that amount of app inefficiency, it takes a while to settle. It's approximately eight to 10 times slower. Uh, because the draw calls, we just can't get it through the OpenGLES driver uh, fast enough. Um, so go from 30 odd frames a second down to uh, four, and from 700,000 draw calls to under 100,000, then back to back to Vulcan. So you can see that Vulcan does indeed give you significant advantages.